welcome to Girl Talk. We are thrilled today with our show. We are here at Orange Theory Fitness. Kelly Ogden has joined us. Stephanie Collar is here and Coach LA is here. And you know, we're really excited about this show today because we're actually going to experience what it's like to come to Orange Theory. And Kelly's been trying to get us to do this for a long time. So Coach, we're really excited about it. What we're gonna do, just so everybody has a game plan, we're gonna talk for a minute. We're gonna say goodbye. And then we're gonna get on here and actually show you what we're doing. Before we start, can you all both give us a little bit of an overview about what our audience is gonna be experiencing with us? Sure, so um, we've got three blocks here. It's the treadmill, the water rower, and the weight, uh, weight room. So LA is going to take these two through a couple paces of that mm -hmm. and um, just kind of show you what it's all about. And I don't know if you wanna add something. Uh, so we're going to be uh, also looking at the heart rate monitors, so uh, what that's going to be doing while we're doing each three of the blocks. So uh, where you want it to be in a warm-up versus if you're actually starting the block, uh, as well as if you're wanting to increase your rowing pace, where your heart rate needs to look for that, kind of some math numbers you need to add to with that. And then on the weight floor, uh, kind of going over that your heart rate will tend to drop um, you're not going to see as much of those splat points that everybody likes to get on the weight floor just because you are uh, bringing it down a little bit and standing more and doing exercises versus being in a cardio mode on the water rower and the treads. Coach, I have a quick question. This is for you and I. At 65 and like 20. <laughs> <laughs> you're so kind. <laughs> and different fitness levels. Um, what about accommodations or how do you deal with people at different ages and is this a good work? out for people at different ages. Yes, so we have uh, what we call options. So we don't like to say modifications or accommodations just because we want it to make sure it sounds like even though she's demonstrating this, I can still do that just at a simpler um, you know, way. Okay. So for instance, if uh, the rest of the class is in a plank uh, on their hands mm -hmm. and on their toes, the option for anyone that's got any shoulder yeah, surgery. Yeah, I have a special spot. Right. If you have some things that are going on, um, you can take it to your knees. So uh, you would still keep those hands up, or if you wanted to take it down to your elbows. Uh, we also use the benches a lot as well, so that you can use that um, to kind of increase the uh, plank technique. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's going to say something. <laughs> So, Talking about a plan. Exactly, I love it. Let's do this. We're going to go ahead, we're going to take a break. We'll get on the machinery and Coach and Kelly, you'll kind of talk us through and we will huff and puff and ask questions as we go. All right. All right, stick good. with us.